Good morning. Um, I just wanted to take a minute to introduce myself to you. If you are watching this video, it's because you are either taking human interaction or skills for successful parenting with me, uh, Jody Hitchcock. Um, I wanted to introduce myself to you before we started the class because as a human interaction and um, parenting class, there's a lot of engagement, interaction, and it really helps if you get to know each other before we begin. Um, again, my name is Jody Hitchcock. I'm a social worker by profession. That's what I went to college for. Um, I've been teaching at ECC for about six or seven years now. It, you lose track when you're having fun. Um, anyways, that entire time I've been teaching human interaction, I added parenting about three years ago, um, and I love teaching both of those classes. They're both favorites of mine. Um, a little about myself. Um, my area of expertise in social work is perinatal social work, so pregnancy, birth, delivery, postpartum. Um, my research was in the postpartum period, specifically postpartum mental health issues. Uh, in addition, parenting is an expertise of mine, uh, so when I was able to add the parenting class, I was really excited to be able to have that component um, since that's something that has been a huge interest and area for me to focus on. Uh, so if you have any questions, if any of you are looking to become social workers in the future, reach out if you have any questions or uh, want some feedback on how to go about getting uh, started in the field or what classes or programs you could take for that. Uh, on a personal level, I am married. I have five children. As you can see, I'm sitting in my car right now recording this video because I have five children and... I currently have four dogs living at my house as well, so it's a very crazy, hectic time. Um, not to mention the room I usually work in. Um, right now, my neighbors are doing construction, so it's very loud in that room. So I am hiding in my car to do this introduction for you. Um, as far as my kids go, most of them are older. I have an adult daughter. I have two, actually I have three adult children. Two are in college. One is uh, self-sufficient, well, kind of technically. I have a junior in high school, and I also have my baby, who's not so much of a baby anymore, will be a uh, sixth grader, so a first year middle school student. COVID has left us doing a lot of things differently, including this introduction here in a movie format recorded and posted on Blackboard. Um, that is not the norm. Usually I teach these classes seated in person, so this is completely out of my comfort zone. Um, it's not the way I love to teach this class, but we're going to make it work and it's going to be amazing and we'll all get through it. So. Please feel free to email me at any time if you have any questions. I'm going to add a video after this that is going to go through all of the information for the course so that you will know what to expect. If after you watch the video and then review all of the documents independently on your own, if you then have any questions, please feel free to email me at any time. Um, I usually am very quick in responding. Sometimes if it's a weekend, holiday, something like that, there might be a slight delay. But please, um, it's very important that we all connect, interact. That's the point of the human interaction course. So make sure that we're doing that. And if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. Um, next, I look forward to watching your introduction videos. Please include um, anything that you think is important. I have a list of questions. The most important question, though, that I expect for you to respond to is, what is something that's unique about you? I know that for many of you, your first response is going to be nothing. I'm boring. There's nothing special about me. I don't have any interests or hobbies or talents. That's not true. There's something about you that's special and unique just to you. But the problem is, is that a lot of times when it's part of you, you don't see it as special and unique. So you might have to ask a friend, family member, ask your mom. She'll tell you what the most special thing about you is if you're stuck. But I want you to make sure to include that because it's an important part of our class and getting to know each other. 
as far as something that is special or unique about me. Um, I'm an animal lover. I'm a reader. I have no significant um, musical talents or anything like that, but I do love adventures. At this summer, I've taken, I did a high ropes course in the Adirondacks, and that was scary and thrilling and awesome. I love um, kayaking, adventures, being outside, swimming in any way possible. I love the beaches and the oceans. Um, so those are some interesting, fun things about me. So I look forward to hearing what you have to say. Please post a video if possible. If you absolutely can't post a video, then a document answering all of those questions will be accepted. But it's really important for the first impressions that I see you and your beautiful faces if possible. Okay, welcome. I hope you enjoy this class as much as I enjoy teaching it and I look forward to getting to know you this semester. Goodbye and I will see you soon.